Tesla boss Elon Musk has introduced big discounts on the price of cars, potentially inaugurating the first EV price war. The $450 billion car company's industry-leading profit margins mean it has plenty of ammo. But as a global downturn looms, it may not be enough to sate Musk's goals of world domination. A growing gap between the number of cars Tesla produces and delivers to customers means that margins were doomed to shrink. Musk faced two choices. Either he could let demand fall further short of supply, potentially leaving Tesla's rapidly expanding and expensive factories sitting idle, or he could cut prices to boost demand. Musk chose the latter option. While that hurts, it may help Tesla stay ahead of rivals who are elevating their own electric vehicle ambitions, but who do not yet have profits to sacrifice. But Musk doesn't just want to jockey with other EV competitors. He has said he wants to build a globally dominant automaker like no other, reaching 20 million sales by 2030. Gross profit from Tesla's core automotive business, less sales of regulatory credits, came in at $12,473 per car delivered this quarter. Zeroing out that profit could reduce Tesla's global average selling price to around $38,950. This ignores possible savings as increased sales volumes deliver benefits of scale. Still, that's well above the $21,550 US, US starting price of the Toyota Corolla, the world's best-selling car. As the US Federal Reserve raises interest rates, increasing the cost of an auto loan, while other markets slow, Tesla is facing the real possibility of falling short of its goals. The company may simply outgrow the market for high-priced cars, requiring further steep discounts to soak up its output. Indeed, Wednesday's results don't include the impact of another round of price cuts in January. There's more pain still ahead.